want to see it. This is fucking nature leveling the table. This is what Black Rifle Coffee is all about. You ready to go fishing? fishing? Yeah, way better than four hours in traffic, right? Catching sailfish, tuna, possibly marlin, mahi mahi, and just a good time, man. Fun, freedom, fishing with your buddies like this encapsulates everything the company is and everything it aspires to be. I am like. I am tingling, I'm so excited for this. Yeah, we didn't get a fucking thing in Costa Rica. Today is a different day. I am so pumped. I cold started my body, you know what that is? No coffee? I didn't have coffee. It's like starting your engine without any oil in it. That's what it is, it's a cold start. We are going to have so much fun. Like it's beyond fun. You have no idea how exciting it is to be going into the Pacific Ocean, off the coast of Guatemala, going after the fish the size of me, if not bigger. I don't think there's a fish that's as big as you in the ocean, but yeah, it's really <laughs> exciting. I do this all the time when I'm camping. If I don't want to bring a stove, for instance, I'll just drink cold brew. Cold brew's really good. Fish on! Oh, see? See, look at this. I can't make coffee, man. I'm like trying to make coffee. It's fish on. Get in there. Holy shit. Holy shit. Get the fuck out of here. It's the biggest fish I've ever caught in my life. Yeah, it was great, it was incredible. That was fucking awesome. Now I gotta finish making this. All I do is I pour a little bit in. And the reason I only pour a little bit in, I wanna mix it up a little bit. And of course, you can use whatever you have in order to stir it up. So I can drink it as espresso, which it's great. Fish on! Or just straight coffee like I'm drinking now. It's on it! Our customers make all this stuff possible, and I can't thank you guys enough for this. Like, all we want out of this is for you guys to be inspired, get out, do epic, awesome stuff. So when we're building these pieces of content, or when we're going to these places and selecting great coffee, we're also having an adventure. We've got to go out and do that. We're, we're just giving you a little bit of access so you guys can go out and do the same thing. Woo! Also, just like filming that, filming that was so much fucking fun. <laughs> Fish 
took off with the line to the forward of the boat, my rod slipped out that way and then the line cut. Like I still had a hold of the rod, but it came out of this and then all of a sudden the line was cut. Fuck. Yep. I got real excited and so now the adrenaline's dumping and I got nothing, you know, no satisfaction out of it. We'll get the next one. Third time's a charm. Hopefully. Yeah, I mean, it's challenging. I mean, just look what I'm dealing with, like the purest form of, you know, man against beast. You're out here trying to outwit each other. Hey, Sean. Oh, shit. gonna go your way every single time like whatever your quarry is it always has a fucking boat and that's what makes it challenging you know for me more fodder in the canon for future stories and i firmly believe like the best storytellers are people who have the most life experience to draw from to influence what they do and so if you're not constantly getting out there and stimulating yourself and putting yourself in different situations whether they're comfortable or uncomfortable or whatever that well of creativity is gonna run dry you guys want to go swimming yeah yeah This is an adventure that no one in the group will ever forget. It's incredible. Feeling down inside.